to palpate the spine of the scapula, we will start from the acromion process and we will move posteriorly, medially, and slide to the spine. To palpate the vertebral border of the scapula, we will ask the patient to put his hand on the small of his back and then from the spine of the scapula, we will move inferiorly and this will be the border of the, the vertebral border of the scapula. To palpate the inferior angle of the scapula and if we reach the end, we will feel the inferior angle of the scapula. To palpate the axillary border of the scapula, if we move laterally and superiorly, we will feel the axillary border of the scapula. To palpate the superior angle of the scapula, we will start again from the spine of the scapula, go medially and posteriorly, and if we move superiorly, we will feel the end of the scapula, that is the superior angle of the scapula. To palpate the chromion process, we will start from the jugular notch, go laterally along the clavicle, you will feel the acromioclavicular articulation, and then after that, you will feel the acromion process. To palpate the coracoid process, from the lateral most aspect of the clavicle, lower your fingers distally, approximately one inch, and push your fingers laterally and posteriorly, and you will feel the acarified process.